Welcome, today I am with Motorola Moto G100 and I will show you the most useful features that you can find in the camera. So at first when we start from the photo and the video mode, in this mode we can quickly adjust brightness level manually. So when you tap on the screen and move this icon like that, you can increase or decrease brightness level. You can also make it manually by double, I mean by tapping on the screen once or double tapping. And the same in the video mode, just take a look. Okay, right now let's turn phone to the normal portrait mode. And we can also find right here when we expound this menu, we can add timer. So we can set 3 or 10 seconds delay to our shutter. It's useful when you, for example, want to take the group photo with your main camera set. So we can put your phone on the tripod, select 3 or 10 seconds delay, tap on the shutter and then go to uh, I mean into the front of your camera uh, the rear camera and you can just take a pose and be captured in the photo when you go for the settings we can find right here in the photos oh no it was on AI settings no sorry guys it was on the capture settings yeah right here we can find top anywhere to take a photo so take a look when you hold your phone like that in the one hand and you are unable to reach this shutter with the left hand and with the right one you can tap on the screen and the photo will be also taken of course you can block this shutter delay and then you can take photos like that i'm gonna turn off this option right now because i don't need it when you go right here for the three lines, right here, we can find the 64 megapixel mode. So let me show you how it works. I'm going to take photo of this uh, bottle of the water that you can find here. With this ultra resolution mode and with the normal mode. Okay, and take a look. Mm, this photo was taken with the normal mode, or maybe not. Well, let me just take a look on the difference. Okay, so uh, this photo was taken with a normal mode, and take a look right here. We can spot some details. It looks not that bad. But when you go right here, we can zoom definitely much closer, and we can find more details, for example, when you're looking right here. Take a look. Honestly, we cannot read what is right here, but in this one, we can. Like this, four or three last letters. So in this mode, we get basically more details on the photos. And the last option that I will show you, it's the dual capture. So we can record video with two cameras at the same time, with the front and the rear camera. You can switch these cameras, and you can switch the theme of it so you can make you know this small preview on the right upper corner or can of course move it to the left or right or the middle side you can change the camera mode right here so we can go for the normal lens to the ultra wide lens and that's how it looks take a look you can press on the shutter and you can shoot the normal video you can also take photo by tapping right here and that's all if you find this video helpful, remember to leave a like, comment and subscribe.